Good morning, good evening, and good day. Thank you so much for watching Attack Power Gaming. Today, we continue our How to Play the Division series with the Task Force 45. We are going to be playing it on Balanced. We are playing Mr. The Great Jellyman. And he will be playing, ooh, 2nd ID or 2nd Infantry Indian Head. And he's on Maverick. Ooh, this should be exciting. So, two American divisions going up against each other. Lovely. Lovely. Actually, that really does help. That means I don't really have to worry about dealing with, like, super heavy armor when I don't really have it myself. So that, that it could be a big deal. Uh, you did the launch battle. I'm not sure what he means. So we're gonna send some ammo pioneers here. Uh, this map is, it's fine. I'm not a huge fan of this map. It's really unfair for him, not gonna lie. If I can capture this forest, then he gets pushed off this flag. It's it's not hard to push him off a number of flags and really capture some stuff early. So that sucks for him, not for me, of course. We use our ammo and pioneers here because I, I do need to capture these spots. All I have here are converted gummer gunners to start so we're just gonna do what this deck does and spam away spam spam spamity spam all we do is spam those gunners spam I think one here will be fine let's do one of these taxi ready all right sorry sometimes these guys lines their voice lines do get kind of old um, hmm. My T70 should actually do quite well. It really should dominate. I would love some sort of AT capability over here, but I mean, it's not like they have a ton. Remember, I know, I kind of know what I'm dealing with here. My HMGs will do quite well out in the open here. So, if possible, I do want to get them in here. Right there and there should be good. Let's send an M8. could do some pretty great work if uh, you know he doesn't have a lot of AT in terms of infantry AT he has basically none so it's definitely going to be challenging for him I do definitely want a leader here as you can see I'm putting a very high priority on capturing this area I'm gonna send one of my last remaining HMGs to this position just in case things go real poor uh, Airwise, just the fighters at the beginning here. All right, let's hop back over here. So cavalry scouts probably should be coming in the. Oh, maybe they can't come in the jeep. Maybe that's why I don't have them in the jeep. I would assume that's why I don't have them in the jeep, but I don't actually know for sure. And then of course we don't really have much of a choice here. I'm kind of spreading them out because I really don't want all of them to die. Like right here at the beginning, that would be a bummer. That would be a serious bummer. I could send the T-70, but it's super light armor means it'll probably die. And I don't want that. I do want to use my T-70s, but they need to be used correctly. So I'm going to use the M8 to get to cover this road off for me. And... Uh, did he ever say what he meant? No, I didn't get what he said. Uh, just a um, min, thanks. Okay. People always say, You're set up too slow. I don't care. Get over it. Also, I have to talk to you guys. Which does make it take a little bit longer. Okay, tank. Let's get... Uh, let's just get a Sherman for now. See if he's happy about that or upset about it. 
Some people are excited and some people are not. <laughs> really kind of depends. I do want to make sure I get there. And you know what? Let's send one here for funsies. Also, you know what? You know, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's be mean. Okay, it's not mean. Let's be clever. Sneak cavalry scout somehow into a bazooka position. Don't know how I'm doing that yet, but I'm going to figure it out. We'll go on the fly. Ready? Thanks. Good luck. Have fun. Now, the problem is I have big artillery, but he has bigger artillery, although he's Maverick, so I don't think he'll be able to go nuts on it. Problem is I'm not going to get to really take advantage of mine. You kind of have to bring this because, you know, if you play a long game, it's great. It's super, super good. If you're in this sort of game, you know, balanced on Maverick, it it's not going to have as much of an effect because the game's not going to go. You're either going to lose by minute 30 or you're going to win by minute 30 for the most part. It's not going to end up to a point where your artillery is going to get to grind out its value. So it's real. I'm probably not bringing these in. I will. There's a good chance I'll bring some of this stuff in. You know, a mortar half track right here could do some serious work. We'll see if I have the points for it. Also, this flag too sucks for him. Really hard for him to capture. Yeah, I really, I, I prefer this angle. He's got some pretty, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, vetted troops. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Ah, boogers. All right, well, forcing an unload is just as good here. Get in there. Start moving. I don't want him to... You know, have line of sight outside of that area. That's really important, actually. Ah, uh, something's already dying, and that's bad. Wow, he really snuck that thing in there fast. Two of those things, okay. Let's get an M1 tank destroyer out here. Oh, okay. Let's move these converted gunners up as well into this position. I don't, I'm not sure how they lost so definitively, to be honest with you. Let's go there. Should have a pretty definitive advantage there. Let's call in some mortars. Let's see if we can start taking advantage of that early. So Zalm G guys are definitely definitively beating me, so let's get two more converted gunners in here. Triple star. Okay, getting the work done. Gotta give him credit for that one. Very nice. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get cheeky here because again, I'm not super worried about uh, you know any sort of Oh, this is bad. This is that's just bad, you know. Trade wise. Hmm. Not sure how I feel about that. I definitely would like some more here. There we go. There we go. Right here is fine. Oh. Oh, that was a flame. I thought that was a bigger weapon. What do we got here? That's unfortunate because I'm going to get punished for retreating him too soon. Oh, well. What you going to do? Kill the ranger, kill the ranger, kill the ranger. There we go. This is the problem, so he's letting his his he's letting his infantry micro themselves, and that's bad.
But I have air wise, nothing useful. Alright, we got this now. He's gotta have something probably right there. That's how he's keeping control of that point. So we're gonna get rid of it. Forgot to call him in and, and uh, whatchamacallit, unload. So let's do that. Let's call a Wolverine here. Uh, M M18 tank destroyer, sorry. I know they're slightly different, I know that. Let's go him first, see what we can do here. That is unfortunate. These guys are very strong though, so I mean it's not particularly shocking. Especially at two stars, they're, they're very strong. Yeah. I'm going to move this guy back here. Move up my cavalry scout to a slightly more dangerous position. I'm going to move this guy up, put him on return fire. I wish this would actually die. There we go. Thank you. It's nice of you. All the semi-automatic rifles. Kill, kill, kill. That one came in at the wrong spot. Alright, so we were able to push them back. That's cool. Where is this m one a I know I called one in. Yeah, like forever and a day ago. Let's go, bro. 16-8. Oof. On the Maverick, that is bad. Let's call that in for him. Alright, we go. Got to take out his leader. 100% worth it. Yeah, and, and this is definitely more due to the map. And this is just a crap map for him on this on this uh at on this angle on his side that's the word i'm looking for his side is bad like his side is very bad on this map we should probably move this a little since we have the time to think about it uh da, 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 da. a t70 on this hill could be ra really dangerous let's do it it's not the best use of a t70 to be honest but that's okay that was a clever move to try to get that bazooka in, but it's going to not pay off here at all. He's going to be mightily punished for that. And this is where you get to see the converted gunners really start to do some serious work. I want to fall back. I don't want that. You can see how dangerous those things are. You want to put the uh, put your mortar on a you know control group. So in mine, I always do one, uh, just because I know what it is then. Oh, what? There's another one of these. No! Oh, gosh darn it. Do you know how long I waited for that thing to get there? Let's call Sherman in instead. Unload, 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 unload. There we go. Alright, we're in position now. Are you gonna shoot or what? Are you waiting for an invitation? Let's go. What? How'd this thing get pinned down so fast? Is that like, why is that not moving? That's definitely some sort of like glitchy thing. This is very ballsy. Let me let me note that right now. It's probably a bad idea. Ninety percent chance bad idea. Two seventy though. Oh, <laughs> that is the problem with the T seventies. I let them be in range. I let an enemy troop get in range. Oh, what is this baloney sugar now? Two v one, bad. Oh, he's let me. Ah! <laughs> there he goes, killing my cavalry scout. That was not very nice. All right, he's making a nice push back here. Ten fourteen was able to push it nicely back. Still in a good spot though, obviously. 
Now, he has obviously recognized my lack of armored defense. So I actually call my T-70 in over here. I can sit it pretty far back and hopefully be able to use its range advantage. Alright, very nice. We were able to take out one of those M4A1s. That is great. Let's call on our own Sherman here to try to solve this problem. Phase A is about to be over, which is good because we have a lot of weapons that get unlocked in Phase B that we really kind of need, actually, to start uh, doing some damage to him. I'm a little confused why this thing's really not effectively firing and what exactly it's doing right now. Because I gotta tell you, it's gonna make me really mad. Alright, let's get an actual thing that kind of belongs in these positions here. Yep, that would be helpful. Slight change plans. Get him there. Oh, good lord. Unload! Now, the problem is he drove these guys out with no infantry support, so they have no eyeballs. They, they can't see Jack Diddley. We're going to call in a P-47 here. These are disgusting good. Did you miss? Did, did you actually miss? Oh, my God. You've got to be kidding me. So now his little push here is going to basically go completely unmolested, which is really obnoxious. T-70, do your job. Boom. Kill. All right, there we go. Once these are taken out, uh, this bottom side should collapse right back to me here. Boom. There we go. Back we hum. Dun -dun 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 -dun. I would love it if you would un fall back now, unsuppress. That's the word I'm looking for. All right, here we go. We're gonna we're gonna delete this thing. After he does it now, if you are so like my I have auto. Winchester turned off if you have it turned off make sure when you have this situation that you queue up a retreat order right after oh He's got AA what? Bro, you do not have the points for this you are losing you you should be using points on all of this kind of stuff Yeah, I think you have been too if you go down without ever doing anything. I'm gonna be so peeved All right, I will say that caught me off guard now th this is this is gonna be an issue. Don't think I didn't see that happening. Hey 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 hurry 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 rude, rude rude. There we go. Yep. Let's punish him for this little motion here. Oh 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 oh. Okay, hey hey hey. Get out of here. Get out of here, bro. Oh, that's that uh the howitzer. Ah. Oh. I don't know about that. Questionable is all I have to say. Oh my god. Shut up. Just shut up. I don't accept. No. Get out of here. I do want another one of these because I do want this. Uh, Artie. I need some Artie. Here it comes. Group one. Give me some support. This is where the fight really begins with his maverick income. I now have to fight back hard. I, I didn't. Re I want it. Yeah, fine. Be like that. Let him move forward, and we shall kill. Now, right here is probably fine. I don't want to move him up too far because remember he's got that uh, he's got the AT gun there And that could actually be a serious issue Because I'm not like heavily armored or anything. Well, I'm gonna call in some support for my Which I'm gonna call it here pretty early Oh, you know what I want another support gun here as well It'd Be nice if you kill it. No, no is he actually, like, threading this needle? I'm really impressed if he is doing that. We're gonna put these ammo pioneers on return fire. I just need to see what's out here. Like, I really need to see what's going on out there. Now, we're gonna get some of our... close-range dudes here. M4A1 on M4A1. Who shall win? Probably his, for no particular reason. Okay, so... I need to find that stupid... whatchamacallit, that got away.
M4A1 destroyed. Okay. Well, that was kind of going to happen eventually. Let's get these guys back up here into position. Fifty-nine still in my favor, doing quite well. We're gonna put these guys on group two here. I can obviously see what's coming. Oh, you get out of here, bro. What? What is the point of view? Yes. I'm willing to take this. I feel good about this engagement. Group two. Go kill him. Go kill him. I changed my mind. Go kill him. Eee! There's a second one over there, but I can't see it now because I lost my recon. Oh, that's unfortunate. Let's bring another one in. We're going to need it. I do need to be able to counter this stuff. That's not question. That's not in question. I need to be able to do that. All right, group two did what I needed it to do. Fall back. I hope these guys can get through without getting killed. Where is it? Yeah. Death. Death to the steward. I need more. This this is literally just gonna be a it's gonna be a freaking Uh it's gonna be a freaking prickly hornet nest of horrible things. Right, I'm gonna set him up there. You know, let's let's get some Nisei's over here. Yeah. Oh boo. Rhinos? Get out of here, rhinos. Here's the issue, he definitely has better uh better armor than me overall. You know, with those rhinos and stuff, he's obviously got a stronger loadout of tanks. You know, me just having Shermans. That is literally all I have. I don't know if I'm going to win this fight. I'm going to back up if I'm not already dead before I do. I need to get past that 1500 range marker. Oh, no. I feel bad. Oh, all right, there we go. Good, good, good. All right, there we go. That's out of the way. Cover the leader. The leader is too important. Got to defend those leaders, folks. Defend them leaders. Should rename that a DFL. Oh, <laughs> that's a division. No, 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 no. I did not mean to do that. All right, let's. No, 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 no. Right there, right there. Get him. No, no, no. Get him. And do it again. Two. What? Seriously? Oh my god, whatever. I hate you. Oh, oh, there he goes. Those howitzers. Annoying. Yeah, let's try let's try this thing up here. Calling the rhino too. Let's see what we can do. Not the rhino, excuse me. The Mitchell. Set up the ev evac order after no, he's got AA over here, too. Wow. So that's where he put all his points. Freaking AA, apparently. Jeez Louise. Now, my, my two-star guy should be plenty, honestly. Did not do much. There that goes. Okay. Nisei's push forward. I should be able to beat anything in that woods, honestly. Kill, 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 kill. Yes. Finish him off. Oh, no, no. Move, move, move. And then finish him off. Let's call in our second uh, mortar half-track here. I think that's a perfectly reasonable use of him. I'm going to call in some more Nisei rifles over here. Where's my cavalry scouts? 
I really wanted to cross the road to get to him, but I actually don't think I'll be able to do that successfully. Let's just let's just call another one in. Got plenty of points. I am floating a lot. He's calling in a lot of tanks now. Uh, let's call another M1 tank destroyer here. Oh wow. Okay, I'm not upset about that. That's great. Group two, hit me up some artillery here. Ah, uh, I was. If I had higher suppression, I could. I could have retreated and maybe taken less damage there. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, let's uh, let's just call this in. Let's see, what is it? Is this just like a giant Hellcat blob monster thing? Okay. Interesting. Let's call in two M1 tank destroyers. Once they're dead, I'm in a lot of trouble. I did kill his leader, so he definitely committed a big sin there, letting his his uh, leader die. Now we are in phase C, though, so advantage me at this point. M4105. Oh, okay. I guess that was kind of inevitable. And I'm going to set this cavalry scout up in case he decides to take like a big push. Now it's 1311. He has pulled it back very nicely, but he still only has two minutes left on the clock here. Killed that rhino and recaptured that. Wow, a lot of leaders. Good for him. Good for him, to be sure. Okay. Okay. All right, let's let's get our let's get our artillery involved here. We're gonna need a little bit of uh, whatever you call them, what you call it, supply, supply. That's the word. These are rifles. Fix my problems. Okay, there we go. Problem solved without me. Oh, okay. We're just we're just we're just we're just rushing. I need to turn off this APCR. There's really no need for it. The Hellcats have paper armor. Like, it's literally just there to look pretty. Uh, I think... Well, we'll find out. Let's just push this guy forward. Let's see what happens. Move this ahead. Airwise, nothing special. Easy kill there. Let's see if we can catch either of those. I don't think we did. Very nice push on his part here. I, l I lost my leader. Crap. Didn't notice that. There we go. Good. Artillery. Let's call an I. Whatchamacallit. Artillery commander dude. And with pioneers, this is actually good. They'll trade, hopefully. Which means I basically, you know, he loses a whole engineer and I lose just a weakened squad of those guys. So that's actually a great trade for me. GG, he's calling it. Oh, he did bring it to a 12 12, though. Is he, is he scooping? I mean, he's obviously, like, in a bad spot here. I mean, he's basically out of stuff. Or he's he's in his bad, you know, his bad ammo phase, and I am fresh and powerful. Let's shift this guy this way. Let's bring in some... Sherman's. Alright. Most of those Hellcats are dead. He has a 1311 right now. His his phase B rush is is giving him the power he needs currently. But now it is going to start running out here. Especially as I start bringing in the more competent troops in the Nisei rifles and such. I want to go, go home. Oh, there's that. They're probably just dead deleted. I'm making an assumption that they are just dead deleted. I could use more pioneers, please. That is problematic. Group two, throw me down some mortar. I'm, I'm expecting him to walk forward, so that I'm taking a ballsy play there. I need to back him up. Hope I don't insta die. Gun jammed. Ew. Come on. Uh -uh. 
And don't forget, we still have converted gunners for days. And days. And days. And days. And some more days. Keep going, bruh. Putting him on return fire, just in case he doesn't notice me. Uh, this doesn't actually have a great chance of penetrating. It's going to take a lot of time. A lot of shots. But this will definitely kill him. Only a few seconds remaining here. There we go. A little pop. That's fun. Show me your moves. Some down there. And we call this game a nice victory there. With a lovely... Uh, 25 minute victory on Ilomantast, Ilomantsi, excuse me, versus the Grape Jelly Man. Play on second ID. We had a nice large KD difference there, so we did quite well. Uh, let's see the KDs. This M4A1 did good. That was up in the north. Converted gunners doing what converted gunners do best. Overperform. Oh, this M1 did quite well. I do not like destroyers very much. I don't find them to be very efficient, but against other. Uh, Western Allied divisions, they, they do pretty well. They can actually kill Shermans, and Shermans don't kill them super duper fast, actually. Sometimes they bounce shells, which is kind of embarrassing. Uh, I'm 40 good here. Ooh, six pounder. Look at that. Pulled a couple kills. Oh, wow. My six pounders did a lot of work. Six pounders can do work against American divisions. They struggle a little bit against Shermans. At least they should struggle more than this, but once they get closer, and obviously it looks like we picked up some side shots. Hellcats. I love Hellcats, but I, I don't know. I don't like paper tanks. Glass can, glass cannon tanks really underperform. Feels like they should do really well, and then they don't. Uh, yep, Hellcat killed a couple things there. I mean, they do kill stuff. Again, it's not that they don't. They just don't. I never find that they overperform unless you micro them really heavily. And that takes a lot of micro. So, hope you guys enjoyed this game. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe. And have a fantastic day.